Hello Cancer, this is Renee and welcome back. If you're new, welcome. You're safe here. This is a safe place for you. Okay, and uh, Cancer, okay, as I was meditating on your energy, I was feeling the Five of Cups energy. So I feel like there's something that needs to be released. There's something that you need to let go of. Some kind of emotion, some kind of energy, so that you can manifest something that's coming forward for you some kind of fertile energy in its place you know i feel like you're releasing something to bring in something better okay uh, let's go ahead and get into the tarot let's see what messages are coming out for cancer okay we have the hangman we have the page of pentacles we have the four of pentacles we have the Six of Pentacles. Lots of Pentacles here. The Seven. We're going from the Six to the Seven. Wow, progression. And the King of Swords. Okay, so there's a lot of Pentacles here, uh, Cancer. So I feel like you're definitely working on something. This may be work. This may be a new project. You may be working on your finances, working in, you know, manifesting something in your life that's going to bring you abundance, that's going to uh, bring you some kind of promotion, some kind of increase. Because we have strength at the bottom. So I feel like you're actively working on this. You're pursuing this new interest that is bringing in an offer that you may not be able to refuse. It may be an offer that is too good to be true, you know, or it seems that way. And I feel like, you know, there's someone here bringing in this offer that is going to be very supportive for you. You know, you may be socializing, you may be gathering around people in your life. Um, uh, for some of you, this may be your new love coming in for you. And I feel like, you know, you're very strong and capable. And I feel like you're able to take this new leap of faith, you know, and take a look at what this new offer is going to bring into your life. Okay, so Cancer, let's take a look. Okay, I feel like you're definitely becoming more aware of your situation. I feel like you've been taking time out to make plans, to really think things through. Maybe you're thinking about how to create more money in your life, to create this offer, this gift that's being given to you. Um, you're really thinking about how you can build up your finances. You know, how you can gain this increase. And I feel like maybe you have applied for a position and now you're waiting for that answer to come through. Well, I feel like the answer is coming to you. I feel like you are getting some kind of offer that is going to bring you some kind of increase. It's going to build up your stability. Okay. With the four of pentacles, this may also mean that you may need to watch your finances because there may be some kind of um some kind of offer coming in for you to where you may need to travel you may need to go someplace in order to take this offer so i feel like you know with this four of pentacles energy i feel like you know there's a need to feel balanced okay you may need to balance your your finances or this is bringing in more balanced finances Okay, but I feel like regardless, I feel like you're becoming stable because there's actions that you're taking. There's a lot of pinnacles here, like I said, so this may have to do with work or finances in general because you're moving from the six of pinnacles to the seven of pinnacles. So there's something that you're actively working on, but there is also a gift that's being given to you. Someone is offering you a type of generous gift, some generosity that is bringing in balance, okay? And I feel like, you know, you're able to take this idea and use it to your advantage. There's an idea that you're working with that you are able to use as your advantage, okay? So maybe someone's giving you some kind of investment tip or, you know, they're giving you some kind of strategy to um, kind of go through this 
legal process or application process you know someone is giving you the strategy so that you can become clear have a better understanding have a working knowledge of what you need to do in order to increase your income and to increase your abundance okay so i feel like a lot of things are becoming clear you're gaining knowledge and wisdom in the situation you know um there's a lot of stability that you're gaining okay and this offer is going to be very inviting that's the words that i'm getting very inviting Okay, let's go ahead and clarify this for Cancer. Let's get some clarification for this reading for Cancer, please. Message for Cancer. Okay, with the Hangman, we have the Three of Pentacles. More Pentacles, look at that. With the Page of Pentacles, we have the Judgment card. The Four of Pentacles, we have the Eight of Swords. With the Six of Pentacles, we have the Four of Cups. The Seven of Pentacles, we have the Knight of Wands. And the King of Swords, we have the Death card. Okay, so look at this. At the bottom, we have the King of Cups. So there's some kind of support coming in for you. There's some kind of stability, some kind of feeling of being valued. You know, the cups are always dealing with emotion. The king of cups is no different. I feel like he is kind of the king of emotions. He knows how to control his emotions. He knows how to be very loving, very caring, very tender and supportive. Okay, so he wants to nurture the people around him to really care for them. Okay, so there may be someone coming in your life who wants to nurture you, or you may be the one who is the nurturer. Okay, Cancer? Um, but you are definitely manifesting some kind of ability. Look at this. We have the Six of Pentacles again. So, you know, there's definitely some kind of balance that you are manifesting, something that you're bringing to life. You're working on this new venture. There's you're working on new possibilities. OK, so let's take a look. OK, with the hangman, there's some kind of knowledge that you're receiving that is going to, you know, help you collaborate, help you work with a team, um, help you put your heads together and come out with ideas. OK, that's what I'm getting from that situation. I feel like you're putting your heads together to you know really make something happen okay with the page of pentacles i feel like whatever this offer is i feel like this offer this gift is bringing you you know out of your comfort zone and into something new some kind of fresh start some kind of you know new awareness um kind of moving you out of your comfort zone into being able to manifest even stronger look how this hand is coming out of the clouds and bringing new life you know this this hand is kind of bringing the dead to life so to speak okay so i feel like something is bringing you out of out of your comfort zone to bring something into awareness something into your life that's going to be some kind of fresh start some kind of new beginning you know feeling refreshed feeling revitalized renewed giving it new life okay so very interesting cancer okay with the four of pentacles we have the eight of swords so i feel like you may be holding yourself back in the situation these swords are self-imposed you know so there's nothing really holding you back but you yourself okay so th there may be some kind of old beliefs that you need to release so that you can come into this more stable situation so that you can work on this um balancing 
of your finances this this longevity okay so there's there's definitely something that you need to release some kind of beliefs that you need to release maybe that's the reason why i was feeling that five of cups energy at the beginning you know there's something that needs to be released here okay with the six of pentacles we have the four of cups so i feel like there's some sort of situation that you're truly thinking about um, but I also feel like with this Four of Cups energy, there's something that you may be a little dissatisfied with. There's something that you are finding kind of confusing. Um, you're not sure if it is something that you want to act upon or something that you want to leave behind. But I feel like, you know, this Six of Pentacles energy is worth taking a look at, but it's also worth doing your due diligence, you know, taking time out to really think things through. Okay. Um, but I feel like, you know, the, whatever the Six of Pentacles is, I feel like, you know, it may not be everything that you thought it was because I feel like you're kind of unfulfilled. You're not very satisfied with the outcome. Okay. With the Seven of Pentacles, we have the Knight of Wands. So I feel like there's some there there's a situation that you really want to act on. There's a situation that you really want to move forward with. You may have a certain idea that you really want to put into action. I feel like now's the time. Now's the time to try it out to see if it works. You know, to throw it against the wall, see you see what sticks. Um, but I feel like you know there's one opportunity here that you're really focused on. And I feel like it is time now to take that chance. Okay. This may also be that you are going to be traveling sometime during the end of March. Uh, you may be going on some kind of adventure, some kind of travel plans that you have. Okay. Um, with the King of Swords and the Death card, I feel like you're not, you're going through this total transformation here. Okay, I feel like your thoughts are changing, your belief system is changing, you're, you're moving into this more awareness, you know, having a better understanding of things. It may be that you're reading some kind of books that are helping you understand where you want to be, where you want to go, what you want to focus on, you know, maybe you're manifesting more and you're reading on how to be more aware, how to be more, more prepared to manifest, you know, uh, but I feel like you're becoming more aware of the situation. You're transforming your situation. You're transforming your beliefs. Okay. So very interesting. Let's get an outcome for cancer give me an outcome spirit give me an outcome for cancer what's going on with cancer give me more messages okay we have the eight of pentacles the high priestess and the king of pentacles wow okay so whatever this is that you're working on at the bottom we have the ten of pentacles wow Okay, whatever this is that you're working on, Cancer, I feel like you just need to trust. Trust in the process. Trust that you're building up whatever this is and you're making it flourish. Look at all these pinnacles in this reading. This is filled with abundance and knowledge of how to go about getting more increase more abundance and i feel like you just need to trust yourself in the situation trust your intuition follow the lead of the universe and this abundance is going to come through for you i feel like it's going to provide you with more stable ground more stability you know if this is a person this is someone who's coming in who's very stable very loyal very grounded um, this could be an earth sign coming in for you um, or a um, Pisces as well cancer okay um, so I feel like whatever you're doing you're going in the right direction cancer you're bringing in stability you're bringing in your wealth you're bringing in your contentment, your satisfaction, having what you need, needing what you want, 
okay so i feel like you know you are definitely on the right track you are working in the look at this you are working in the right direction you know you may be doing research you may be really learning new things you know and i feel like as you're learning you are becoming the teacher in this situation because you're moving into this direction if you are open to love i feel like love is coming in for you if this isn't love cancer this is something that you love to do this is making good solid choices okay because look at this we have the king of cups again so something is being very supported something is being grounded that is going to bring you increase and in wealth okay so just hang tight cancer because what you are manifesting is going to become 3d is going to become real okay so let's get some moonology cards for cancer what does cancer need to know spirit give me a message for cancer Okay, we have a new romantic cycle begins. What did I tell you? I feel like, yeah, this isn't, this not only is of pinnacles and of wealth, this is also a new cycle that's being created. It's time to release negativity. There is something that you need to release and you need to take a look at your life and see what that is, Cancer. Um, but I feel like whatever this is, I feel like it's working in your favor. Okay, let's get a manifestation moonology card. Okay, we have new moon in Leo, shine. You know, let the world see the real, ca uh, real Cancer. And we have full moon in Aries. Call your emotions. Okay, don't get too excited about things that are going to happen. And because it is happening for you, Cancer, just hang tight. Be strong, be capable, and go with the flow of the universe. Keep doing what you're doing. Stay on that path. But, you know, don't be too uh, hasty. Okay, we also have weight. Like I said, don't be too hasty. Okay, listen to your intuition. Follow the universe's lead. Okay, and we also have get more information. So make sure to do the research. Do the follow-up. Okay, now let's get a, a, a angel card. What angel number do we have for cancer spirit? What angel number do we have for cancer? Okay, we have...